What's up, guys? It is me, Nathan, and I'm here with... What's up, guys? It's me, Gabe. Say it again. They can't hear you. What's up, guys? It's me, Gabe. And today, we're going to play Heaven Quest. This game I found at Goodwill. Two bucks. Good deal. <laughs> so, what do you think of this so far? It looks like a drug trip. This game is, um... Is this an anti-drug PSA? Uh, maybe. Hey, no fricks on this server, so let's go. Uh, that's help. The phone. Oh, that's their website, internet. The phone means get it. Oh. Oh, uh, so how do you start? How does the game glitch? There you go. Stop. <laughs> the game. <laughs> so you start by clicking this. Number of players. Two. Player one select. I'm going to pick... Grandma Moses. Um, medium. Who do you want to be? Uh, this guy. Mostly medium. So I think who goes first? Grandma Moses. Ready to go, my dear. Ugh. What, what do you think of this? It, it, it looks like this crappy YouTube animation. Just listen to that, to that 90s elevator music. How's that for you? Oh. So you pray to store up grace. That's how good because Judas got that those pieces of silver. Huh? Yeah. That was, that's how Grace. He hung himself. <laughs> so we pray. And we move. You are tempted. So the Lord said to Cain, Why are you so resentful and crestfallen? If you do well you can hold up your head, but if not, sin is a demon lurking at the door. His urge is toward you, yet you can be his master. New American version. Choose a stone tablet. One is Judas. <laughs> uh, John. Who was Rebecca's father-in-law? I don't know. Isaac. Oh, I don't give, I don't give a shit. Bible. I don't know Bible. Alright, your turn. I want to pray. It doesn't matter. I already have full grace. Alright. What did the prophets say? Who would be called a Nazarene? If you don't get this right, Messiah. Good, good job. Ready to go, my dear. Grandma Moses. Actually, you can turn off the music, but we want that elevator music. 3D scenes? Yes, oh. that's, they're, they're on. Um, Bible translation, King James, New American. I picked the New American since we're, I guess we're most familiar. I don't know. Yeah. His King James can be confusing. Up. Mm -hmm. oh. Bounce it out with Caesar over here. I'm not full grace. <laughs> Which is the only commandment with a promise? Huh? Um, this is my question, so... Let's see. I don't know. Love God above all is not a commandment. Which is a promise. Honor your father and mother, that's not a promise. Keep holy the Sabbath day. Honor your father and mother is a promise? Huh. Don't know that. You're up. Oh, I want to pray. You are tempted, Gabe! Oh, why are you so resentful and crestfallen? Choose a stone tablet, Gabe. I'm gonna get Judas. You gotta John. go on like I did. Alright, you have to answer this here. Let's move this over. Zacchaeus. Uh, you get to go again, hey! Oh, I'm gonna pray. What did God make on the fourth day? Um, birds. Sun and moon. You oh, dumb Dumbo. Okay, sorry. I, don't I, know can, that. I can't say dipshit. This is a Christian video. Hey, no fricks, no hex, no craps. You're up again. You're doing so damn good. God's free gift of grace. Okay, I'm gonna move. Oh, that's me. Wait, so that was your turn. Wait, the game glitched. This is me. Okay. He overthrew those seas and the whole plane. 
together with the inhabitants of the cities and the produce of the soil. But Lot's wife looked back, and she turned to a pillar of salt. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> Bitch. Oops. Hey, this is a Christian server. Oopsie. Choose one. The Pope picked Judas. I would piss my pants. <laughs> Of whom was Isaiah speaking when he said, A voice of one calling in the desert? I don't know. I have no idea. Well, Jesus wouldn't have been there. Grandma Moses. Grandma Moses. <laughs> no. This is like... That, like, those old CDs you used to get when you were a kid for, like, Sunday school music. <laughs> this, this ain't? Okay. Of whom was... I don't know this. Do you know this? I have no idea. Um... Elijah. Oh, okay. I don't know! You're up. I am tempted. Oh shit. Jude. I almost... Was Judas! Oh, almost. Hey look, uh, down there. That's uh, Abraham uh, sacrificing his son. No worries. It's all good. Ready for battle, my lord. You're up. Abraham joins you as your Bible buddy. Oh yay. Abraham just got done sacrificing the, his son, so that's good. You're tempted. They told Joseph to Ishmael last year twenty pieces of silver. They pulled Joseph and his sister. Was it twenty pieces of silver for Judas too? Uh yeah. Okay. Choose one. If I would, Jude, if I would pick Judas, that would have been funny though. Who prophesied during the period after the temple was rebuilt? That was Malachi. I don't know how I knew that, but I did. You're up. Oh, why do I keep getting tempted? Um. Zechariah. Whoa, we're Bible wizards. Oh, I beat you way past there. Allah Akbar. Anywho, what did King Darius do when Daniel spent the night in the lion's den? I use, I think I might have known this at one time. Threw him back to the lion's den. Uh, I want to. Yeah, please. I don't know why that popped up. Um. Oh, that's a shame. Probably mention people. I don't know. Ready for battle, my lord. You're up, sir. This prophet is not from the time the Temple of Jerusalem was being constructed. Oh, how about this guy? I can't feel it. No. Abraham leaves you to return to his altar. Sacrifice his son. Oh, my dear. I don't even have Abraham. I'd bounce with the good old Caesar over here. Is that Bob Ross's thing? <laughs> I don't know. Does that sound like it? Kinda. Happy little trees. Oh my gosh. That sounds so similar. Oh my gosh. Yeah. The joy of painting. The joy of painting. What did God do to the people who were building the Great Tower of Babel? Oh, he ch he changed their language. Yeah, you're up. Um, well, Mary's not on here, so I don't know. Well, would have, that would have been Jesus, right? Yeah, because Jesus was dedicated to his God, and okay, you're up again already. Hurry! What would we do? Hey. Hurry! you beat Caesar, good job. Okay. Which is not a son of Joseph? Um, man asses. Alright. Male asses? Like man asses? Yes. Ha! Good try, you didn't get it, I didn't even know that. <laughs> Who kept his brothers from killing Moses? I mean... Joseph! Uh, Reuben. 
I love me some New York Reuben sandwich. Oh, my God. Yeah. Need some grace, boy. Bob Ross will help you. Thanks, Bob. Uh, Kings. Okay. Oh, that's a jam. You read Proverbs. I know. Do you know what it was saying in there? I don't know. It's been a while. Who broke the commandment against fashion? There we go, Aaron. Three are Judas. Ready for battle, my lord. Good job. That's perfect. I picked Judas. Oh, it's you. Oh. Oh, okay. When a famine came, to where did Joseph's father and his sons found grain? To Egypt. Ready for battle, my lord. Yeah. People will watch this video. Mm -hmm. what, which of Jacob's sons became father of priestly tribe? Uh, Levi. That's great! You did it! You solved the Bible trivia! Um, I need pray. Ready for battle, my lord. I hate how it does that, though. It's like you pray, and it's like, oh, you can't do your turn. Who's the man who lived to be 969 years old? That's super easy, dude. Uh, That's so easy. Uh, if you get this wrong, you are an idea. idiot. <laughs> <laughs> it's Methuselah. I don't even know who that is. He's the oldest man on earth. Oh, birth of Christ. For today in the, is the city of David, a Savior has been born for you who is Messiah and Lord. And this will be a sign for you. You will find an infant wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying in major. We're already in the New Testament? I guess. That was fast. Yeah. Where, where's the two female bears mauling, bears mauling all those children? Wait, that, that, that's too much for a Christian game. <laughs> Anywho. It's me. Oops. That's you? Yes. Oh, I helped you. Thanks. You're tempted, Gabe. Seven, Seven are Judas. Judas. Uh, ooh. Dang it. There goes your grace. <laughs> hey, look, the sun's pretty damn bright. Oh, it's you. It looks like a, a ball of sun. That's a star, right? Uh, yeah. Was it this? I, oh, I wasn't there. I thought you were. I, I was Jesus, but I didn't know what was going Wait. on. Matt Schmidt would love this 1990s elevator music. I'm sure. Hey Matt, if you're watching, this is like elevator music from the 90s, man. It'll, it'll make, it's a good, good music, right? Pretty dank. Mm -hmm. In his epistle to the Ephesians, Paul says we must equip ourselves with the sword of the Spirit. You probably wouldn't have known that, were you? I actually did know that. Okay. Is that Jesus being baptized right down here? I don't know. Goliath of Gath came from his peop this people. How do you get that? Yeah. I remember some of this stuff. Alright. Hey, look there. David. I have no Bible buddies. Okay. Can you like pull your chair up over here, please? Yes. All the way. So you have to sit and they can hear you. Jesus was born around the date is not exact. Five. That's BC. About five BC. Okay. She just said zero AD. That's what I was taught. Right? Yeah. I moved. What did Jacob give to Joseph? Okay. Beautiful music. Hey, hey, old, old, uh, 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 pastor's wife playing that piano. Okay. Where was Jesus when the chief priest soldiers came to arrest him? Garden of Gethsemane. Of course. Ready for battle Why do I think... Uh, I just thought. 
Oh, it's Christmas. Merry Christmas. The ascension was when Jesus returned. Ready for battle, my lord. You're up. Good job praying. That took you up a lot. Yeah. Don't read your scriptures. Why don't you read your scriptures? What do you mean? I'm pissed. I've been reading my scriptures this whole time. The Pillars of Solomon's Temple was decorated with... I have no f c clue. Did it! You're get the oh, it's get you. Oh, I'm holy now! It's you again. They were thrown into a furnace by a Babylon king but did not die. It's the second one. I actually know that. Thank you. You helped me. You're tempted. He said, Come, Peter got out of the boat and began to walk on the water towards Jesus. But when he saw how strong the wind was, he became frightened and beginning to sink. He cried out, Lord, save me. James the Less. You're tempted. When he returned to his disciples, he found out them asleep. He said to Peter, So you could not keep watch with me for one hour. Watch and pray that you will not undergo the task. The spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. Wait, listen to that. This got, like, very unsettling. How? We went from all's happy, cheerful, and now we see Peter sleeping in the desert. It's, like, all depressing. Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. No more happy, jolly pastors while playing that piano. Now it's just sadness. What, where are we at, Easter? Pretty much. When Abraham and Lot divided up land between themselves, who took the best land? They were talking about No, it was Lot. Okay. You're behind. I know. Lot left his home to escape from... I don't know. Something. I don't know. That. Okay. Oh, yeah, because the city did get destroyed during the time period. David leaves to go face <laughs> Goliath. He so, so he'd rather go fight Goliath than be with you. Is pretty much what he's saying. Yeah. Wow, you're good at Bible trivia. You're tempted again. At that time he began to curse and to swear, I do not know the man. Immediately a cock crowed, and Peter remembered the word that Jesus had spoken. Before the cock crows, you will deny me three times. And he went out and began to weep bitterly. Two are Judas. Really? Out of all those, I picked Judas. Yeah. That's too easy. Who made this game? That's too easy. I get like, oh, you know. Haha, <laughs> I beat you, Caesar. Take that. The crucifixion is happy. Mm hmm. And about three o'clock, Jesus cried in a loud voice Allah, Allah, Lema Sabak Sanani. I don't care if I didn't pronounce that right. Which means, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? It should be more depressing than that. Sev, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? I mean, what is this? Is this Beethoven being deaf playing with his music? <laughs> why is there a rainbow? Yeah, Jesus died. Like, if this, they should have had part, where is his resurrection? You know why? There's a door there, and that's the end of the game. Oh. We end on the crucifixion. So is it over? Yeah, I beat you. But you can still go. I mean, you can beat me if you want to get there. Moses lived before Abraham. <laughs> Are you really thinking that? I have failed my beating. What? <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Can you go, my I get he's risen, but didn't say that, right? Yeah. It's okay. These are fishermen's sons. Uh, Andrew and Simon. 
So do I have to get all the way there? Well... Grandma is coming to... She's coming to I won! Wait, what? What is this? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> is this the Terminator movie? What the hell did we just play? A uh, Bible trivia on acid. The people who made this game are obviously on some drugs. <laughs> a bunch of pastors came to a room. And they said, let's make a game. Then they smoked a doobie. I'm excited now. Yeah. We won! I mean, I won. Nathan wins at a game finally! It had to be a, one of the worst games I ever played. Hey, look. You got 50% right. Oh, that's good. You got like, what, 60 or something? That's the game. Yep. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. See you next time on Butter Games. What do you think of the game? Uh, it was like... Different. It was like Sunday School on Acid. Yeah, uh, kids, parents send your kids to Sunday School on Acid, and they will definitely enjoy this game much better if you get it for them. See you later.